Screaming Donkey, how can I help you? Oh, hi, yeah, can you put a bunch of pickles on the table? Uh, pickle isn't code for something else, is it? I just posted the story, and I've been getting these requests. Nope, just little cucumbers. Oh, great, yeah, thanks. Uh, I, yeah, I guess you could maybe freeze-dry them or put them in a bag or something. Wait, why would you have to freeze-dry them? No, epoxy and water just don't mix. They're definitely not friends. Oh, okay, cool, that makes total sense. Can I ask why pickles? Um, do you really like pickles or something? No, my uncle hates them, and I'd like to replace his desk with a pickle desk. Is there any way you could make a table smell like pickles, too? Strangely enough, the answer is yes. I got bored one night and started looking up how they make vinegar flavor, and then I found this website that sells all these different kinds of flavors and smells. Oh my god, that would be freaking awesome. You know, I've never made a spike gift. I'd actually be pretty excited to do this. How serious are you about making this? 50-50, I'm on the fence if it would take the table and use it somehow afterward, because I know the bastard would throw it out. Sorry if this is too intrusive, but can I ask what he did? Got drunk at Christmas and open mouth kissed by girlfriend. Ho <laughs> Are you sure Pickles is gonna cut it? I could totally make a table that looks like it's full of dog turds. I think you're underestimating how much someone can hate an inanimate object. Oh yeah, I get it. You should see me with a sticky floor. Screaming donkey, how can I help you? Oh yeah, I saw your story on the pickle table. I absolutely loved it and I have to have it. Oh cool, you saw the video, you know it's a thousand bucks, you know that it is a 2 by 4 coffee table, and you know that it's first come first serve, right? Oh yeah, but first I just want to know if you could do it with white oak instead of walnut or maple. Yeah, that shouldn't be a problem. And instead of a coffee table, could I get it as two end tables? Yeah, I think I could probably do that too. And I really want them to be nesting tables. Can you make them nesting tables? Yeah, that's kind of difficult with how the design is. You'd probably have to pay a little bit more for me to agree to do that. What about if you did it like this, and I'm going to send you a picture of that? Yeah, I could do it like that. Okay, can you give me a total price? Yeah, it's just like the video says. It's a thousand dollars, and it's first come, first serve. And there's been quite a bit of interest in it, so I think I'm going to have to, in the sense of fairness, move on to the next person if you're on the fence. Okay, I'm just going to talk to my husband, and I'll get back to you whenever. Bye. Screaming donkey, how can I help you? Ah, uh, yeah, has anyone taken that pickle table yet? It's a thousand bucks, right? I'll take that effort and stick it right in the middle of my living room. Ah, uh, yeah, nobody's taken the deal yet, and it's first come, first serve, so if you get the thousand bucks, I'm ready to rock. Oh, uh, yeah, great, great. I was just wondering if you could go ahead and throw some LEDs in there for me. I could, but I don't recommend it, because believe it or not, LEDs do burn out over time. There's a good way to put them on, and I can walk you through it. Oh, yeah, that makes total sense. Uh, let me just go ahead and run this by my wife, and, uh, I'll get back to you on it. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Uh, just let me know. Uh, hey, wait, before we go, can I run one more thing by you? Can you give me a quote on something that's as evil-looking as you could wrap your mind around? I'm really into horror and stuff. You know, I've been waiting for the right customer on this one, so I got two words for you. Cthulhu Table. Oh, that sounds sick. I think you found that right customer, man. Yeah, it'd be about $2,300 plus shipping. That's fair. What do you need for the design fee? Like eleven fifty? No, let's call it eleven hundred. All right, all right. Sounds fair. All right, let's do it. So, uh, no need to call your wife and run this one by her? Only the pickle table, right? Uh, yeah. No, that's cool. I totally blame my wife for stuff like that, too. Yeah, you mind if I use this as a story on my TikTok? Do it, buddy. It's okay to be weird with wood.